Hello once again YouTube and welcome back to The Domain. Today, you join me back in my studio for episode two of the Domain Community Spotlight. This is the celebration of all things Halo Mega Constructs across the community, and it takes place on our Facebook group, the Mega Constructs Domain. For the month of October, we set you guys with a new challenge, collections. This is where you could post any photos or videos of your Mega Constructs collection, and we would pick 30 of our favorites to feature on this video. I mean, I literally cannot believe how much awesome Mega Constructs people have, and also how much of it. Like, some of these collections are wild. So we're gonna go through them one by one. But before we get onto all the fun today, I just wanna take a moment to highlight a, a very moving post that all of our community, my admins and myself, just found so beautiful that was posted on our group about a month ago. It was by a guy called Jose David Carrillo, and unfortunately, in May of 2020, he lost his son, a terribly tragic event, and actually one of his posts was sort of informing us that his Mega Constructs collection that he shared with his son has been a great healing process for him over the last couple of months. Uh, he actually, I reached out to him and he sent me a picture of his son's collection and a statement as well, which I'll read uh, to begin with. This ever-growing collection has been built up in honor of my sweet little Prince Lucian, whom passed away on the Black Tuesday of May 5th, 2020. My little Spartan is now continuing the fight in heaven, but as they say, Spartans never die. I just thank Jose David for, for letting me share this with everybody, and also to know that in some way this is helping him through the healing process. It's, it's an amazing thing that Mega Constructs, I guess, connects all sorts of families together. So, before we get on to the 30 posts from our community this month, I got a couple of announcements. First of all, our Facebook group hit 600 members. Thank you very much. And welcome our two new admins as well. I'm so lucky to have Spiteful Mega Constructs from Spiteful117 and Z Fowler from Demarcation Media, both as new admins on our Facebook group, which is a true honor, and I hope I can grow the admin team even more with big names of the community. And I wanna give one more shout out to Brian Johnson at Toro of Ultimate Doom. He's another admin on our Facebook group, and he just works tirelessly to bring amazing content to the community. Also, I apologize if I mispronounce anyone's name. I'm trying my best. We're gonna announce this month's giveaway winner at the end of the video, and how you can win the next giveaway, but let's just get straight on with these posts. I've collated four of our admins and four amazing collections on the screen first. We've got Brian Johnson's collection, who I just mentioned, Z Fowler's, Daniel Cockrell's, which I also see there's an SS Motion shirt in there, very nice. The King, Thomas Bovey with his son Daniel Bovey, who uh, he, his collection just like blows my mind every time. He is Ms. Rhea Armory on YouTube, you should definitely check him out. Our admins, as you would expect, have colossal collections in this community, so I like to share those real quick. Let's get on with the show, it's collection time. We've got Brandon Edmonds, a pretty awesome collection, and I also really am jealous of that Ocean Breaker drop pod. Then we've got Cade Ambrose, he's got his collection with that huge Mega Construct sword, which uh, I don't know if you can see it, we'll be building that soon. Here's Toast Egg's video of his collection, and I also kind of like the dinosaur wallpaper in the background, I think it kind of fits the infinite theme pretty well. Henry Marino shared a load of his collection in a small diorama. I especially love that Frost Raven and a load of different Halo heroes. Brendan Valdez shared a lot of pictures, but this one caught my interest the most. So many Marines. Caleb Lenane is one of the few people to actually have the NMPD Pelican, and I'm so jealous. Jonathan had a lineup of all of his figures, particularly all of those Prometheans are awesome, and those two new mold hunters. Justin Yates is building a nice collection of Halo heroes and a couple of blind bag figures. Jacob Truett posted this picture. Every shelf seems to either have some rare Halo heroes or a signature build, and that Yoda is pretty awesome too. He also shared this epic video, check it out. second video you're seeing is from Jason Mikado. Just look at all those awesome figures. Mm -hmm. 
Ben Thompson posted his collection in a very interesting way where he laid out all of his weapons. And some of those, I don't even know where they come from. Then Daryl Nash posted an insane banished army. That makes my banished diorama look like a child's play. Look at all of those brutes. Over to Brady Moran. He's got the old school pelican amongst many other things. And then Fabian Cog Morales. I don't see many people posting pictures of their sealed collection, but one awesome item is that Faithful vs. Fallen pack. I've never seen that, I don't know if I ever will, but having one sealed is pretty badass. And then Chris Isbr... Isbister... Isbister? And then Chris Isbister posted two legendary Warthogs, the PAX exclusive, and then that one out of like 500 with the very slightly different Flame Marine inside. Uh, they're both pride of place of my collection, it's awesome to see two more. And then Dwayne Jensen seems to possibly have the greatest basement of all time. I don't know if this is under the house or not, but like there is so many shelves here. I don't know how you display all those figures and vehicles. I see the NMPD Pelican again. Somebody's gotta hit me up, I, I need that thing. Chris Chaugnessy posted the new Pelican amongst many other legendary figures and quite a few new infinite blind bags. Then Aiden Chart, another guy to post just an outrageous amount of Marines. He's army building them to high heaven and I definitely approve. He also has some epic warthogs. Then we're on to Daniel Montiel. He's got all of those Master Chiefs pictured beautifully together. I love a good collection of Master Chiefs. Then, and Andrew Kaufman, he's another OG member of the community. I'm very happy to see him posting here. And he's got an epic display. I remember seeing this years ago, but it's like pegs where you can insert the Spartans into, like hoist them onto the wall. It's very innovative and a smart way to save space. A post that piqued a lot of our interests was from Bob Bone. Now this guy, he invented the term microverse, which is like the mega construct shared universe. And he posted epic pictures of his Game of Thrones collection, He-Man, like loads of different things. I definitely I like the idea that all of the Mega Constructs figures share like some kind of multiverse together. It's a cool notion. Ryan Foster posted a video of his diorama with just all of his collection, including a dragon in the background. It's pretty hectic. And then a video from Copen Ross as well. Really cool diorama. Theo Bolton shared his collection with just so many warthogs. We've got a fire base, loads of nice figures, cauldron clash. Very cool indeed. Then I also wanted to give a special mention to Nuke YT. It's not particularly a collection post, but it shows the High Council at the beginning of Halo 2, and I thought it was definitely worth a share. Only five more to go. We've got Jonathan Vasquez. He posted this sick little diorama between Marines and Covenant forces. Then Jamie Thompson won my heart with his NMPD collection. I'm always a sucker for those guys. We've got Hataya Orionis, who posted the full fire team Majestic. And then Daniel Wong, who cleverly recreated the COVID-19 Halo 5 Guardians relief campaign. Really cool picture. And we'll finish today with Cody Wright, who posted this insane video of his collection. And I thought I'd just let it roll on the screen for a while. Hope you guys enjoy. collection posts from across our community only 
on the Mega Constructs Domain Facebook group. I mean, this it's so good. I love this community so much. And I announced last month that you could win this Spartan Mark 7. All you had to do was just post on our group. And we chose a post at random. Congratulations to Tristan Gibbs. PM me your address. I'll send this to you free of charge. And next month, We've got one more giveaway, a Halo Infinite blind bag. If you would like to win this, it's the same. All you have to do is just post on the Mega Constructs Domain Facebook group this month, and you can win. What, what is this one? I think it might be a Marine. Who knows? All you need to do is just post on our Facebook group, and we'll pick a winner. That pretty much does it for today's Community Spotlight video. Second episode. I'm feeling great. This community is just growing more and more. And the last thing I have to tell you today is if you join our Discord group and post in our new channel, the Domain Art Submissions, I choose some of my favorite artwork to display on the screen at the end card of most of my videos. Here's a few that I've been seeing recently. They're just all amazing. Thank you very much for joining. No, well, my community on Discord, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, wherever you are, you're more than welcome. This was another video with The Domain, in collaboration with the Mega Constructs Domain, in collaboration with all my amazing admin team, and all you amazing members out there. Stay awesome, and the Forward Unto Dawn is signing off. Shh.